Today we're gonna to make an all-American classic, 15 minutes to make a sloppy joe. Get started on making our sloppy joe. We're here on the stove. We're gonna heat up two tablespoons of olive oil, a half a cup of chopped onion, as well as a fourth of a cup of green pepper. We're gonna cook that. Okay, this until our onions are translucent. And next we're gonna add in our ground beef. So I'm gonna use one pound of ground beef for this. I'm gonna break up the ground beef. So now while our meat's cooking, we're gonna add some seasoning. We're gonna do a quarter of a teaspoon of black pepper, a half a teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of brown sugar, one teaspoon of yellow mustard, one teaspoon of garlic powder. I'm gonna mix this together. Next, we're gonna add in our ketchup and our Worcestershire sauce. So, everybody, you can make fun of me. I have no idea how to pronounce this. Is it Worcestershire, Worcestershire? I don't know. But we're gonna put in one tablespoon of that. Three fourths of a cup of ketchup. Look how easy that was. Simple, easy, I hope your kids will enjoy this. Quick dinner. Put that up. We're gonna let that cook for a few minutes before we make our sandwiches. Our sloppy joe is ready. This took about 15 minutes, super easy and fast. This is definitely not a recipe that I grew up with as a kid, but it's something that my kids enjoy, so I make it for them now. So we're gonna do with our rolls. You can use your favorite roll here. I'm gonna scoop these on. And if you don't wanna make this a dinner it, option, you could do this just like as a snack when they come home because this is so fast to make. So we're gonna take some shredded cheese on top because everybody in this house loves cheese. So we're gonna put that there. Look at those sandwiches. Also, if you're having a party at your house in the winter, instead of doing like a chili or something like that, like this could be an alternative to that with ground beef. Put some cheese there. These actually look pretty yummy. Okay. I'm actually gonna dig into this one. For the full recipe, visit NikkiGlekis.com and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel.